Oh, let me just do this. So it looks like a new day. All right, guys. So welcome to my February favorites. For the last favorites video, I didn't get as much views views as I thought that I would have gotten, but I did, however, received only one thumbs down. So looking at the glass, you know, half full rather than half, half empty, I'm gonna assume that you like this type of videos. Okay, let's go. So the very first favorite is, of course, this was coming, is one of my color pop palettes, and this one is called Cute AF. I have done multiple looks using this palette product from this palette. The only con about this palette is that it gets so dirty so quickly because it is white. Now the reason I love this palette, it may not be obvious to some, but these colors here, they could be richer, they really could be richer, but I love the fact that I now own um, a palette that has these transitional colors in there, the reds, I love our good red, and yes, they could be richer, they could pop way more on my skin tone, but for what it's worth, what it is, I like it. The next palette that I love from Colourpop is their Semi Precious palette and I absolutely love this colour right here. This colour right here is really really nice. I haven't used all the colours but I are finding myself grabbing and reaching for this palette even when I'm not recording um, to do, uh, to do, to do like, like a lid colour. I find myself reaching a lot for that palette when I want to do lid colours. Lost in the moment. So next is my MAC Pro Longwear Concealer in NW35. First of all, nobody could tell me that the MAC concealers, these concealers, are bum. Yo, they do not crease, son. They don't crease, son. No creasing, you know, with some, well, for me, some concealers, you know, my Sedona Lace one creases sometimes, I tell you that. Foundations, they used to like, to, like, for this look, I did, I used my concealer, the MAC concealer, and I used it to cut the crease, and I'm telling you, it doesn't crease. I love this so much. I have to buy, like, a, a wide range, and this bad boy is going in my kit. Why has, why is no bunt? I don't know, but I don't think anybody, okay, the people who I watch, they're not talking about this, you know what I'm saying, like, they're not, oh my god, pro longwear concealer, I love it, I love it, so let's go to my black owned items, I have one item, um, well, one of the items, the I this is a lipstick, it's called Risque Business and it's from Shades by Cal and I'm wearing it now. It's like a hella light pink. I would normally put another color in between, um, like on top of this color when I want to bring a little pink to it. But this is already like a light peach. And if you don't know, um, to line my lips, I always, when it's like this brown color, color, sorry, I always use my LA Girl Espresso Lip Liner. That lip liner is a bay. You need it in your kit, in your life. In a bedroom, in a bathroom, you need it for counseling sessions. You just need it. So yeah. Oh God, this look, this hair is giving me a life. All right. So that's your skin business. I know I'm on to three products from. First of all, she's my girl, Jamaican own black girl. She's Jamaican. She operates in the U.S. I believe New York. This is called Rose Glow, and this is Face by Shana's highlight no okay you might catch this wasting but look at this ah! you see that i love it so much i've been reaching for this glow since i got it from her shana baby my baby mother shana baby mother my pro there go there i uh let me just okay okay Okay, all right, all right. I mean, you know, but then this is it. I mix it with another color. It's a top color. You see that? That's what that's what rose glow rose glow do for you. That's what it does for you. That's what rose glow does for you. You know what I mean? I love it. I think she has more. I'm not sure because I only got this one from her. I'm just a horrible friend and business woman. I should probably look on her, look and see if she has any other colors, because that shit. Is the bomb. 
and then I'm wearing MILF lashes. Now, let me just say, her, I don't know if, if it's just, no, no, I lie. Because the other lash that I got showstopper, it was short enough. But MILF, MILF of a big guy. MILF is for the people who have, you know, like, fuller eyes. You know, where you don't necessarily need to cut the lash. Like, that's MILF. That's, that's y'all's. But for MILF, I had to cut the, I had to cut it because it was so long. But I'm wearing it. Hold on, let me move my little hair onto the way. But I'm wearing it now. And you guys, you guys, I love the packaging. So I have Face by Shana Minx, the glitter paper underneath. And then you have a little, you know, spiel, then the name. I love this so much. I'm so freaking proud of Shana. Yo, Shana Maya Koma from far. If you guys are like an, a real, a true, an authentic OG All Dolled Up Cosmetics fan, you know the shop come from Bargain Mall. You know the mama has been around. You know that baby girl is just getting started. You know. You already know. You already know, ma'am. She's just getting sick. You know what? I'm gonna take some pictures like this. I mean, this hair is so freaking cool. Anyway, last but not least, I got this new lip from her. This is her lip is by Shana. And this, I don't know color of this. This is in Berry Licious. Guys, I did a tutorial using this. It was just nice. Matte doesn't move. I have to like scrape it off of my lips to get it off. Of course, it can be broken up with oil, it's coconut oil, or whatever. But yo, yo, Shana, 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 no, sh Shana, what make you go on, so Shana? Shana, this not necessary. Let's do that. But that's it for my favorites video. I'll see how you guys feel about this based on the views and the engagement. If it's not something that you like, then I will definitely won't be doing it. But what I want to include is actually my favorite Instagram for this month and my favorite YouTuber for this month. So my favorite Instagram of this month is Get Bodied by Jay. And this is my way of also showing you guys who are follow on Instagram and also showing you guys just um, um, another aspect of me. If you don't like this portion of my um, faves, like monthly faves, let me know as well. But I like um, watching her recently because of her, more recently because of her journey that she's going on. I believe me um, saying something about it now would draw attention to the cause. Because years ago, I believe she like got butt injections or some, but something like years ago, she got it and she had, she, I can't remember, I know if it's silicone or something, and she had it removed and it has done some scarring and it's like, she's basically starting from scratch and she is a personal trainer. She got it done before she was a trainer and a lot can be said, maybe you don't like Get Bodied by Jay, maybe you do like Get Bodied by Jay, whatever it is, maybe you do, maybe you don't. But I am saying this, I'm saying that to say this, what? Hello? So her journey is basically raising awareness and I like that. It takes a lot to be vulnerable on camera. It takes a lot to be vulnerable on social media these days. Before it was never this serious. No, you have people who literally walk around and follow YouTubers like they're celebrities, you know, and the truth is they are. They're on social media, their lives are being broadcasted. People are identifying, not identifying people as him, just whatever, if they're getting attention. And, you know, so with that being said, she is definitely one of my favorite Instagrammer for this month and my favorite YouTuber for this month. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So I have this anti-Valentine's Day look, but with a twist, of course, because we still need love in our life. <laughs> All right. And I got some new hair. So if you're interested in this video, stick around and keep on watching. Hey, I'm coming home, Savannah. Hey. Okay. She started out as the island beauty. Um, Savannah Silva, and now she's going by Sumi. I don't know if that's her real name or not. I'm not gonna get into that. But she shared something recent, not recently, a couple weeks ago, and I've always loved her. But you know, when somebody just lets you into their life, and you're like, oh, that's why I like you. Like somebody sent me one day and said, yo, you suck your tongue. That's why I'm gonna love you. Come and suck my tongue, too. Her being that vulnerable. First of all, it surprised the crap out of me because Sumi is nothing like that. Like, I, 
like, yo, like, I believe that she'll have like this illness that nobody like can be cured if it's shared. She's like, nope, not sharing. If I die, I go to Jesus. She just strikes me as a very personal person. I've never ever prayed. I've never asked a question because you know I have questions. I have questions, but I've never asked her. I've always respected that. And being that I'm also on social media, I can understand if a, if a question, even though I'm not, I'm, it's not intent, it is not my intention to be intrusive, a question may just come across as intrusive. So, you know, I stayed clear of, you know, asking questions. I've always just watched her and what, what, but what had me mention her for my, what have her been my favorites, I mentioned her as my favorite for this month of February is homegirl just keeps popping out looks like looks 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 just looks i was like i want to do that i want to pop look 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 like you know like i want to attempt it i want to try i want to give a go at it so yeah so that's basically it for my monthly favorites um oh my drop off i'm gonna drop off i'm using a husband's drum stool and it keeps on like I want to screw on good man. But yeah, so that's it for this month. If you guys hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um I actually have a hair as my monthly favorite, but I'll reserve that for next month because right now it's rotted up and I'm not going to put it up because I'm going to rule tomorrow. Gyal. Tomorrow I'm going to do a full on get ready with me video. Hair off it off the day like full on that I'm so excited about that. But yeah, so that's it for this video, you guys, and I'll talk to you in the next one. I'm going to take some picture of that area. And that area that look is a, it's a look. And it's a work. <laughs>